We're back with Pharaoh Fowl, guys. I have a couple statements for you, and you got to tell me, Moses, you're absolutely correct, or you're dead wrong. Go back to your desk job. So let's, <laughs> let's, let's talk about this, guys. And we'll start off with you, Andrew. I say Jose Reyes. In the game Sunday against the Houston Astros, there was a pop-up by Jose Batista. He was on second base, uh, didn't move, but it looked like, you know, he, he was there, there was some intent there to kind of get in the shortstop's way. The ball landed in the infield, kept the inning going. Blue Jays ended up winning that game on a walk-off. I say Jose Reyes totally got away with interference. Even though he was still on second base, he still had ample room to move wherever on Sunday versus the Astros. My comment, fair or foul? Foul? I don't know. I don't know how you put that comment, but... I say Jose Reyes is to blame. He should have been... No, he been he's definitely not to blame. That's his base. He can sit on his base all he wants. This is my chair. Don't interrupt me in my chair. Like, this is... <laughs> he's on it. And the thing, if it's a pop-up, if they catch it, he doesn't get thrown out. So yeah. he's supposed to move to take to himself off. When it's in a fly ball, you're supposed to sit on the base. That's his base. Stay where you are. You agree? Yeah, I would agree. You, you don't want to go off your base for that potential of making a double play. I mean, sure, could he you know, put his foot on there and stretched out, but why, well, why would I do the that? the other side of the base. But why, would I, why would I do that? There's nothing wrong with me standing on was, or staying on my move. base. I was just, yeah. yeah, sometimes you have to do things, you know, within the rules to mm -hmm. win. It's his territory. All right, <laughs> fair enough, guys. I'll leave it at that. How about this one? Uh, you look at Victor Hedman and Anton Strollman. Uh, what a combination. Uh, one of the best deep pairings mm -hmm. uh, in the Stanley Cup playoffs. And I'm going to dare say that both Strollman and Hedman will be the best defensive pairing for the next five years. Is that fair or foul? I'll start with you. I don't know if I want to say fair or foul, but I'll definitely say bold. That's, uh, that's a very big claim to make. There's some pretty good defensive pairings out there, and I think you know, even in Calgary, Giordano is going to give you a, a run, for money, run for your money on that. So I'll probably have to say, probably have to say foul. I, I think there'll, there'll be somebody else out there that'll be be more consistent. I'm going to go with this. Yeah, a slight fair, just because they are such a great pair, such mm -hmm. a young pair, and to watch these two develop over the next five years is going to be great. There could be another Seabrook in, and you look yeah, at what possibly, uh, Keith yeah. on the other end. Right? Mm -hmm. No, nope, so for there's sure. been a lot of great there. All right, guys, thanks for playing this game. Uh, we still have a little bit of time to go for you to sound off in just a few moments and, of course, pay some bills. We'll be back in just a few minutes.